Greetings, it's me, Firebee, and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Enhanced. Last time we defeated Elite Four member Bertha and her ground type Pokemon. And this time, we're gonna make our way to the next member. Let me see if I remember to heal off screen. I did not. Good job, me. Good job, me. I am clearly the most prepared there's ever been. I have plenty of hyper potions. I may as well. Wish you could cut the healing animation short and just cut directly to the point where they've restored however much health they they're going to get. But sadly, that doesn't exist. But there we go. We are all set. Let's take on the next Elite Four member. Oh, it's this guy. It's Flynn. I think its name is. Starburst is not the right person to be leading. I believe Linguini is probably my best bet here, followed up by Kikaputi. Let's do this. This room must be roasting with fire going underneath it. Like, wow. I certainly would not like to be in this room for very long. What's even... Feeding the flames down there, I wonder. Must cost an awful lot in energy bills. Oh, whatever. <laughs> it's the Elite Four, they have money to... Well, the expression is money to burn, but I don't think they ever meant it quite so literally. Anyway. Yo, trainer! You had me counting the days with my fingers waiting for you to come. I heard from Volkner what you did in Sunny Shore. You managed to light a fire in that guy's heart again. How could you not expect me to look forward to seeing you in battle? You're facing a Fire-type Pokémon user with me! Let Flint see how hot your spirit burns! Let's do this shit. I'm not sure I'm quite a fan of this red I'm seeing on the bottom screen, but sure. That's better, I suppose. Really, Iron Tail. From a Nine Tails. A physical Nine Tails. Bravo. But Fairy Type does not exist yet. But I suppose I should just be glad that they didn't start off with a Drought Nine Tails. That would have been. bad. They're gonna heal. That's fine. And we're falling just a smidge behind the level curve. In vanilla Pokemon Platinum, Bertha would have had her ace of Hippowdon be at level 55. So, just in case you wanted another idea of exactly how more... I don't even want to say more powerful. How much higher of a level these are. Doesn't even have Nine Tails in his team at any point, though. Magmortar, though, um, yeah, that's a thing that he normally has. But I suppose the first time around, did not really have a whole lot of choice. Now, did they? Not a whole lot of fire types in Sinnoh. I'm kind of surprised they didn't. Yeah, I'm pretty surprised they didn't give him that. But, oh well. Ah, almost. Flame body. And you have a citrus berry? Yeah. I'm not actually very worried. I can come back and heal that later. But for now, Giga Putty. Thankfully, this isn't his rematch team, because that would be up to level 73 with this Magmortar. Not that this is very much less than that, but you take what you can get. Too bad they couldn't have moved that animation up just a little bit for this particular sprite. 
would have made it look better and not like it's coming out of its armpit. Because that's what it looks like. Let's be real here. Looks like it has a flamethrower coming out of its armpit. Gigi Putty is now level 61. Now I'm gonna send in an Infernape. And I'm gonna switch out to Starburst. You know, I'm actually really surprised. Every single gym leader has had six Pokemon, but these Elite Four members seem to not. Oh, it outspeeds me. That's a thing. That's gonna take a ton of recoil for. Well, would be a ton if it could actually hit me for more than, like, 60 damage. But it can't. And the fly should probably take it out. And it does! Starburst continuing to be an excellent member on the team. Not that that was ever in question. Oh, a Charizard. Rocks, you say? We can deal with rocks. We can handle rocks! I can drop rocks all day. After healing, of course. Yeah, this is a Pokemon that's never on any of their teams. In either the original or the rematch. Another kind of surprising thing. But I suppose the point was to only use native Pokemon or something. Heat Wave is not going to do much. And we will bring the rocks down on your face after getting out to bed. And hopefully not burn. Or that. That's a thing that could happen. I mean, it doesn't matter, we have Hyper Potions to last us an age and a half. But it would be nice if we could actually hit anything. Oh, it's gonna fly. Really? Actually using fly? Alright, sure. Free turn! Pinguini, take some healing. We might just need you if this does enough damage. Kind of doubt it, but... How much will this do? A very laughable amount. A pitiful amount, even. Is this Charizard holding fucking... The hell is it? It's not Silver Powder, that's the bug one. Whatever it is. Of course, when I need to know the name of it, it vanishes from my mind. The one that makes you dodge things. A uh, shiny powder, something like that? I don't recall. Oh no, another free turn. Whatever will I do? Whatever will I do? I don't even need that much. Just go for a Moo Moo Milk. There you go, Starburst. At this rate, we'll have all the healing for the entire battle done before the battle is over. That's not bad. Alright, now Giga Putty. You've got to actually manage to hit. After the heat wave, of course. There we go, finally. And I don't know what Charizard that could live that hit. A lot of experience from these things. A Flareon. I'm sorry, am I supposed to be threatened here? This is a Flareon you're sending me at. What's it going to attack me with? No, actually, legit question. What are you going to attack me with? This is a Flareon. 
I can feel your determination. Your will is overpowering me. No, this waterfall is overpowering you. Try it, Flareon. Try it, Flare Blitz. Show me your moves. If you have any. Which you don't. I highly doubt that crit mattered. Level up. Plus five attack. Not even bad. That's a pretty nice attack stat. Wouldn't you agree? Exclamation mark. I don't believe it. I lost. I didn't take you for granted. But I didn't expect you to win. I'd never even considered it. I'm blown away by this. You and your Pokemon are hot stuff. Dots. More dots. Even more dots. Even more dots. Is this Professor Rowan I'm talking to? Phew. Burnt right down the cinders. Do you... Do you need a water bottle or something? You're probably in danger of heat stroke in this room. Unless there's somehow air conditioning with fire going on. Which would be... Pretty against the purpose, but... You know what? Whatever. However you want to handle the situation, sure. But uh, I think we're going to have to exit this room pretty soon. And take on the next member of the Elite Four. But that'll have to be next time. So keep an eye out for that. And until then, farewell.